subway surfing proving once again it's dangerous and deadly. A 15-year-old boy was killed on a train in Brooklyn. And people riding outside of trains in New York City has skyrocketed 160 percent since 2019. The trend amplified by social media. And in response, the MTA now calling out social media companies to take down videos encouraging the thrill-seeking. Eyewitness News reporter Johnny Fernandez is live in the East Village. Johnny. Yeah, good afternoon. And police just released the name of that 15 year old. 15 year old Zachary Nazario. He uh, died as he was subway surfing on the J train yesterday. He and his family live here in the East Village. And police say that this trend is dangerous and deadly. Just in December, someone died. And before that, in October of 2021. The latest social media trend has 15 year old Tatiana Rivera and her grandmother questioning the new definition of fun. Do you think it's worth it? No, not at all. No. Risking your life just for a few views and for a few followers? Absolutely not. No. This is Citizen at video from the deadly scene on Monday evening. Police say the 15 year old was aboard the J train. He was standing on top of a northbound J train when he was struck by a pole as the train was crossing over the Williamsburg Bridge. Unfortunately, I, I think it's just one of the many trends that that um, I think young people mostly are going to be doing. It's the MTA released new numbers showing an increase in incidents of people riding outside of trains have doubled since 2019. Videos posted on social media, part of a growing trend that city officials want to stop. The trend was brought up in a subcommittee meeting today. The subway system is not a playground. Subway surfing is not only illegal, it is super reckless, extremely dangerous, and people die doing so. It was a really a terrible, tragic incident of this young man, and our team is going to do a host of things uh, to bring awareness, to speak with other young people, and really show how dangerous it is. For Tatiana and her family, they also want the trend to stop and believe parents need to step in. The parents got to get a little tougher and know where their children are, even though they're going to do what they're going to do. But I think the parents have a little, have to be a little more strict. Now, the NYPD and the MTA say that they are focusing on train lines like the J and the M because they go over places like the Williamsburg Bridge, which is a very popular spot for subway surfers. And we also know that uh, they're asking media companies to take down videos of subway surfers, a trend that is dangerous and possibly deadly.